<laughs> oh, that blows my mind. Oh, I cannot believe that just worked. Holy! What? Yeah! Hi everyone, Mike Hudson. I'm here with my Model Y 2024 long range, about to go on a, another test drive of full self-driving supervised in Australia. But right now I'm heading out to the country, which is Williams. It's about a two hour drive on country roads, overtaking lanes, God knows what's out there. I can't wait to see how this performs. I've done these drives so many times, but never with a feature like this. And I've been dreaming about this. So come along, let's see what it can and can't do. Let's do it. Yeah. Oh, aggressive. All right. It's so weird. One of the main things that I'm finding weird is just not holding my hands on the steering wheel. I can comfortably just sit back. But I've got a feeling getting out of this intersection, especially on a Sunday, there is a constant stream of cars here. I don't know how it's going to nudge out. This is a busy place. Oh my God, it wants to go. Right, okay. Well, I'll give way here for a while. Wow. I have like a never ending stream of cars and people coming across from the other side as well. Here's a gap, is it gonna go? Yep, we're going. Oh, hook tight, hook tight. <laughs> Okay, I've got to try not to swear, sorry. All right, now I also know turning right here is very difficult. This is a very busy road and there is always traffic coming straight across. All right, indicating. See, this guy doesn't even know what he's doing. Okay, give way, give way. Give, oh shit, stop swearing, okay. I am ready to take control because I'll admit I'm 50-50 on the confidence level here. Unfortunately, we're going to have to get away for quite a while. And then see the car that's in front of me, he's going to turn as well at the same time as me, which could cause us an accident. Ah, yeah. Okay, let's see what's going. Is the car going? Yep, car's going. Thanks, mate. Cheers. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, that's one of the uh, most nail-biting intersections I've had so far. Considering that I drive onto this freeway with this on-ramp every day, I've dreamed about how it would be in this moment. And it just does it exactly how I would do it. I've just even blown away by lane changes. It's so basic, I know, but... See, for me, what's interesting on a drive like this, when I go out to the country, it's usually like you're doing all these little turns and all these little bits until you get out to the highways, and then it's like you can finally relax your hands a bit and let autopilot take over, but full self-driving, I'm gonna crack my little care to bubbly now. <laughs> all right, they got a red, so they got a green, that goes green, and we go, oh. Oh, it's so good. Oh my God. I just cannot get over how good it is having someone do all the annoying parts of the driving if you don't want to. They would have no idea that I'm doing this turn completely hands-free. Well, turn, I should say roundabout. Into the roundabout, turning right, indicating left, exiting roundabout. Yeah! 
Oh, we got a train coming too. Edge case. Edge case. There's a car in front of us, but coming to a stop. Damn it, if only I was just in front of that car. I would have loved to have seen what it done at the rail crossing. I would assume it would have stopped. But then again, I reckon it might even try and curve around it. Like it's just something on the road. Next time gadget. <laughs> Trains just a whole bunch of trucks joined together. Well, wow, not wrong. Oh yep, yeah, sees it as a red light. Red, 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 red. Red lights are off. Car starts easing forward. Yeah. I can't believe it just did a rail crossing. Oh my God, even though there's no lines there. Ah, oh, blows my mind. Really blows my mind. See that? That was a guy texting. He was sitting there just completely looking down, texting away. That's where this technology is good. Like. Don't get me wrong, this is level two autonomy. We're a long way away from where you can sit there. There's five levels of autonomy. One being that you are the driver and you're absolutely doing everything. Five, that the vehicle is doing everything and you're doing nothing. This is only level two. So it's gonna help with the driving that you absolutely need to be attentive at all times. Um, as part of it, if I was to look away from the road, look down or look around anywhere, this camera will actually bug me. Look, I'll test it. If I look down here, even at the screen, one, two, three, there we go, three seconds, and it's saying I better look forward. For years, I've done this intersection going, I wonder what full self-driving would do. Now, I get to experience it. I even want to put the windows down. Okay, it's clear that way, clear that way, it's safe, it's safe, yep. Oh my God. Okay, that was easy, that was way too easy. Wow, it's windy, oh my God. Oh, really good edge case scenario. We've got roadworks here where they close down the road with a little uh, portable traffic light. Let's see, stop here on red signal. I think it's gonna go through. I don't think it's gonna stop. Okay, I'm ready. Please stop, please stop, because it's a one-way road. Please stop, please stop. It's edging, stop edging, stop, yeah. Okay, this is incredible. I think the other cars are gonna get the green light and they're gonna go. Is this seriously gonna work? It's sitting here comfortably waiting. How does it even know that's not even normal light? Okay, even when we get the green. One more car coming. Another, oh, a big truck. Okay, the truck got the red. Okay, which means we're about to get the green. Even when we get the green here, look at this road. There is no markings. We're getting completely diverted with cement barriers. Far out, let's see what happens. Oh my God, okay. Green? Green. <laughs> it's going. Okay. Oh, geez. Oh, my God. Are you serious? No way. <laughs> okay. Now stay on the left hand side of the road. Come on. Holy crap. <laughs> I think that guy was just fun out. I keep swearing. Oh my God. I cannot believe that just worked. Wow. Okay. That is my first edge case encounter. That aced my expectation. Holy. What? What? Okay, we're coming up on the T-junction of Albany Highway. This is one of the main highways here in Perth, Western Australia. Let's make sure it comes to a stop at the T-junction, then we're gonna turn right. Rain's really picking up. We're doing 80, we... 
Okay. All right. I thought it wasn't going to slow down. That wasn't aggressive. That was just like I would do. I just didn't expect autopilot or full self-driving to do it. Okay, it's completely clear, no traffic. But will it get speed up fast? It's 110 zone here. 50, 60. Oh, some heavy rain too. 105 k's to Williams. 80, 90, all right. Okay, this could be interesting. We are behind a truck. Now I know the road curves a fair bit, but we do have an overturking lane coming up in five kilometers. I'm wondering if we're gonna try and overtake it, if there's enough space or if it'll wait to the overtaking lane. Let's find out. All right, here's the overtaking lane. Are we going to overtake? Drum roll. Especially going up a hill, come on. There it is, there's that overtaking lane, come on. Now you're going on to 106. I think he's gonna slow down, sure. See that lane on the right, take it. Take it, take it, take it, do it. Yes, there it goes, yes, ha ha ha, yes. First overtaking on a country road, and it merges back into the left lane. Ah! Oh. <laughs> a few moments later. All right, let's resume full self-driving, press and hold. Let's see if it can get out of this mess, because there is absolutely no road markings here. Oh my God. I would have lost all of those tracks. Trucks, unfortunately, wow. It even avoided the puddle. Are you serious? Okay, road is clear. If you go now, it's clear. Wow. Okay, I just saw wind blow over a tree branch. Okay. And we're back. See, normally on these country road trips, I'm already at the point where I can't use autopilot, but this is just so bizarre. <laughs> Having full self-driving do these turns in the country. How's it gonna give way or go? Yeah, give way, good. Is it gonna go in the gap? Oh, look at that. Nudging out. Wow. Just like what I would have done. <sighs> Amazing. <sighs> At some point, I will become a little bit more used to it and not going crazy every time it does something like I would have done, but it might take a while. <laughs> okay. Going into the venue. <laughs> Come on, go a bit closer. There's no lines now, but I want to go up a bit more. At least I've got the dot on the map that's up a bit more. I wonder if I can view a spot and uh, initiate auto park. That would be the ultimate if I could link the drive to a park, but I think it's gonna stop. Let's see if I tap. Any of these spots would be so good. Can I indicate? Please pay attention to the road. Okay, don't, don't go there, don't go there. Oh, it did come up with the spot. Ah, oh, I missed it. Let's see. If I go like that, and I tap there, indicate, no, won't do it. Oh, I wanna try one more. Is there any other spots? Okay, there's a spot. That one there, that's right beside me. Okay. <laughs> okay, it would have been gangbusters if it had done it as well. Thin. Do not need a car out in the country. <sighs> 
Seriously, oh my god. Oh my god, summary on the drive. Wow, this is mind-blowing. I've just, I've, I've wanted to experience this for so long and finally doing a long country drive. My main thought was Dan O'Dowd is wrong. <laughs> this software is incredible. It is so much better than I expected. That's it. That's done for my drive. Hope you enjoyed. Signing off. Bye.